hi everyone this is Chicho welcome to my channel and uh, welcome to another live stream today is June 2nd 2020 we are living in interesting times and we're doing a live stream open discussion math tutoring session for the year 2020 this is number 11 when I started started the tracking it in January I guess but uh, number 11 for 2020 okay and we've done a lot of these I'm just making myself available for people if uh, they have any questions regarding high school mathematics that we can take care of we're at the end of the year so we're doing one today and we're doing one on Thursday and uh, we'll see where it goes see death to 420 how are you doing CD see death see death 420 welcome welcome I don't talk a lot but I love streams thank you very much for the love uh, CD or should we say see death or death 420 death 420 it's an old man from the 80s don't worry I'm not about that okay awesome awesome good stuff brother good stuff brother and there's nothing wrong with that where I was listening today uh, um, uh, politicians in my eyes from a band a rock band uh, from the 1970s 1960s there were three uh, black brothers that were um, that were doing metal I guess progressive metal and they never caught on but I got uh, someone linked it up on our discord page and I was looping them a few years ago when I discovered them it was amazing uh, so there's nothing wrong with uh, the word death um, that album that that not album but that band was called death and it's some of the most amazing rock you ever heard in your life so death 420 welcome welcome to our live stream wow I need to listen brother you need to listen to that it is fantastic politicians in my life and what's going on right now politically uh, it's pretty important uh, very very profound very profound ripper how are you doing good evening chicho how are you brother doing good brother look look what i got ripper <laughs> we wait until we do the intro how's everyone in chat wow i picked the name when i was 13 from a creeping death metallica song on 47 nice nice awesome <laughs> awesome how are you brother doing well abdullah i'm doing well thank you very much thank you very much i'm gonna do my little intro until people roll in i'm not sure how many people are going to be rolling in for mathematics there's a lot of uh, i'm not sure if notification has gone out or anything right uh so there's a lot going on in the world and it is an open discussion we'll see where the conversation takes us amazing song lyrics are straight from the bible is it uh, which one the oh the creeping death metallica song those are straight from the bible the lyrics for that master of puppets greater than ride than lightning master of puppets was pretty very good album creeping death yeah 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 uh, unfortunately with metallica i uh, loved them but uh, just since metallica came up uh, we'll do the intro to the stream later since metallica conversation come up I loved Metallica in the, in the 80s 90s and stuff like this loved Iron Maiden more than Metallica at the time but uh, Metallica definitely amazing right and during the uh, Napster years and soul seek and stuff like this late 1990s right where there was a lot of p2p fire file sharing going on I had four computers at one time up, uploading and downloading max right and uh, uh during the napster days yeah during the napster days right haha <laughs> napster that was hilarious that was hilarious death you must know that 420 you must know what i'm talking about right with uh, the cartoon that came out afterwards but basically i was one of the f one of the three hundred thousand. i think at the time they metallica came out they got their lawyers involved because people were sharing metallica albums right and i was sharing the whole disc discography at the time right so i got uh, i was one of the 300,000 people they got a little letter from Metallica Metallica's lawyer saying they're gonna sue my ass off right 
<laughs> so I got that letter, and I was like a Metallica fan. I'm like, what? What a... <laughs> I, I started laughing, of course, and I increased the bandwidth and, you know, prioritized Metallica. I did that for a month. I kept on sharing their music for a month. But then every time I was listening to Metallica, I just never finished the song. I would turn it on, and then, what a bunch of a-holes, man. <laughs> I would kept, kept on turning. After a month, I still I was sharing their music, right? After a month, I tried to listen to Metallica, and I just couldn't, right? So I deleted all their songs. And I haven't actively listened to Metallica for 20 years now because they burned their bridges. They came out, Lars came out later uh, and apologized for suing their fans for sharing their music <laughs> but he wasn't sincere about it the reason he apologized was because they started losing revenue right they weren't making as mint money as before so they came out and the rest of the band members are like dude what are you an idiot we're losing millions of dollars you're threatening to sue our sue our fans what are you crazy you gotta go apologize and then he came and apologized right but it wasn't enough he should have put millions behind people sharing files he should have he should have put tons of money into the system to protect people who were being sued from dinglings who were just greedy little sobs who were just trying to prevent sharing of art right that's my story of metallica Aside from that, gang, welcome to another live stream. We're going to do a little mathematics. If you like what I'm doing, I am on Patreon, patreon.com backslash chicho, C-H-Y-C-H-O. If you want to support this work, Patreon is a fantastic way to support this work, and you can just follow the work because I don't put anything behind paint walls. You can take a look at what I'm doing. And if you like what's coming out, and if you ha do have the means, Patreon is a fantastic way to support this project. I am live streaming on Chicho, chicho.tv backslash chicho live, C H Y C H O L I V E. If you want to follow this work live and participate in the chat, Twitch is where you want to be at. Okay. I am broadcasting, announcing certain things on Twitter, Gabs, Minds, VK, and LO. I do announce these live streams 30 minutes before we go live. On all those platforms so if you want to get announcements or whatever it is to join us during these live streams you can follow the work there and uh, turn on notifications or whatnot and of course through uh, twitch and discord you can also get notifications uh, this one because there's visuals involved we're not going to be loading on SoundCloud as a podcast or an independent uh, audio but I might start doing it right but for now, we're just loading anything that ha doesn't have visuals involved when we're having open discussions to SoundCloud as well as uploading some of the previous work we have done over the last 14 years on SoundCloud as audio files, okay? And uh, these videos, math streams, will be loaded on YouTube and BitChute, okay? Almost everything goes on BitChute. Well, everything goes on BitChute and a lot of, almost everything is going on YouTube, but that's gonna decrease a little bit. We just put out a exclusive BitChute video today, which isn't going on YouTube, which is about uh, George Floyd's murder, as well as associated with the 2020 protests and police brutality and stuff like this. So that was a BitChute exclusive. It would have been too much for YouTube censors. Uh, we might have been deplatformed, so. If they're going to act as a publisher, we'll treat them like a publisher. Okay. Aside from that, welcome to the live stream. I'm just going to get caught up with chat, gang. Uh, it's hilarious. Uh, the world isn't a safe place anymore, brother. When I was a kid, uh, things were different. Uh, Abdullah, uh, if you lived in certain parts of the world, it wasn't safe, right? What goes around comes around. What we sow, we reap. Is that the saying, right? The U.S. foreign policy has come home to roost. How, however we, way you want to look at it, it depends where you live, right? Uh, just because what we've been... Uh, just because, anyway, this politics. We'll stay away from that a little bit. I ran a, a zero-day FTP site called sanitarium to ah nice awesome awesome that 420 ripper 
uh, their Metallica newest album Hardwired to Self Destruct has a ton of Iron Maiden bridges in them as direct tributes to the amazing Bruce Dickinson's Iron Maiden. Does it? Am I gonna start listening to Metallica again? I don't know. I don't know. Taco, how are you doing, Taco Operator? Hey, yo. But that sounds amazing. Uh, maybe we give it a go. Yeah. Frame that later. Laugh a lot. Can't blame you. Interesting times. Metallica, we're sorry. Please don't don't <laughs> us go into bank. Don't let us go into bankruptcy. <laughs> Hilarious. Awesome. Awesome. Uh, I'm growing cherry tomatoes and chili pepper plants. Nice taco. Awesome. I just picked up a couple of uh, uh, tomato plants yesterday. They're in our balcony. I cleaned up our grape vines yesterday. So we're setting up our patio and uh, our patio garden, I guess. Ripper, I feel like your math work can be loaded on SoundCloud due to exponential in-depth explanation you do as you're doing visuals uh maybe it's uh oops dependent on the person to understand possibly ripper yeah i've thought about it because i do love just the discussion that takes place right and we do go off on tangents so they're amazing surprises right soundcloud would be good for your smart content too yeah i'm uploading uh death 420 i am uploading on soundcloud now right and i like the platform it's, uh, it's a nice platform x how are you doing uh i just came taco i just came to say hi it's late and i was busy bye bye taco thanks for popping in the silly thing with napster was most of those downloading the mp3s already had bought the albums right i know i had many worn out tapes yeah that's the kicker right that's the kicker we just had it digitally what are we going to do we want to play through the computer we got the music there's a reason why we're sharing the music downloading the music playing the music is because we've been listening to the music <laughs> right we go to concerts right no it is what it is spit out the bone and atlas rise have the best bridges as main tributes from metallica's newest album in my opinion does it does it ripper wow 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 okay so technically it's not illegal to make a backup wow it shouldn't be I'll have to check them out Ripper. yeah me too now you got me sold on the new album I wouldn't mind checking it out right I wouldn't mind checking it out Ripper should we check out something guys there hasn't been a math questions we'll do an open discussion if there's any math that pops up we'll deal with it uh, and if you do have math questions in these streams math takes center stage right uh, just letting you know where I am with uh, these math streams but I know I have a couple of students that they're they just canceled school nothing online anymore now either so I'm teaching them next year material and stuff so there's a lot of people that are just done with school um, it is what it is right uh, so while we wait until there's some kind of math discussion let's do an unboxing <laughs> this is a package that ripper sent okay uh he he asked me if he could send me a package i said uh, sure i didn't you know <laughs> yeah, like i wasn't sure what was what was going on right and ripper just said oh i just wants to send me a package i he mentioned uh well no one can mention so he sent this out like two weeks ago and I just picked it up yesterday it just arrived yesterday so I mentioned to Ripper that as soon as he showed up on a stream we'd open it up if it wasn't gonna be today it would have been next one or next one whenever he had the opportunity to pop up I know there's a lot going on so I don't want people to commit to anything right uh, so he's here and I've just, all I've done is just make sure I had this with me right do you know what sunflower uh, equation what sunflower equation means no but are you talking about the Fibonacci sequence, the the spiral and the golden uh, golden spiral and stuff? A fractal, a fractal. I heard it. Uh, I heard it. SM. So it would be. It would just be more related to fractals, like uh, Death Four Twenty says, right? I heard it was something like that. Yeah. So it's basically uh, uh, the the golden. Uh, ratio which is derived from the Fibonacci sequence should we deal with it uh, are you going to uh, ripper 
<laughs> Let's rip her up. Gina, how you doing? <laughs> hey, Chicho. Hey, Nate. How are you doing? Sacred geometry. Sacred geometry. You know what? That'll be our first thing. Let me. I'm gonna rip her up, Gina. Hold on. Let me make a little note so we deal with it. Okay. Uh, as long as uh, unclear kibbles, unclear kibbles. Welcome to our stream. And as long as unclear kibbles, if you're okay with. Um, waiting until we do an unboxing we'll deal with it right so i'm just going to put the uh, fabinucci one one uh that, 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 that two three dot 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 right that's the fibonacci sequence we start with that here we'll put a zero there too as well and i'll explain to you what that is okay uh that's the most interesting math ever it's a super cool super cool uh ripper uh chicho math takes center stage my friend um i'm good I'm good for the whole stream. You're good for the whole stream. Gina, are you good for the whole stream? Should we deal with this right now? <laughs> Gina, you let us know. Okay. Because math takes center stage. Oh, no, it's okay. I just uh, was wondering if you knew what it was because I don't really understand it. Well, if you don't, then let's deal with it. Let's deal with it. Gina, math takes center stage. So we do. Okay. Now check this out. Unclear kibble. Go for it, go for it, awesome. Now, before I give you this, I'm gonna give you a couple of videos, right? If we do Chicho, doop, golden ratio. Now, golden ratio comes into play in many places, in nature and in art and in our understanding of things. It's fantastic, really. Really, it's, it's, it's amazing, right? It's basically taking mathematics and trying to do pattern recognition to see you know if we can we could figure things out right so here's a video one video that i did regarding uh using the fibonacci numbers to generate the golden rectangle okay which gives you the spiral and here is uh the second one bop, ba -da -da, bop, boop, boop. here's the second one we put these things out in 2013 right and the reason we put these out is because I have a friend, uh, Dirk, which is an artist. He, he's an artist. He's a fantastic artist, beautiful artist, and he's got a lot of geometry in his work. So we put out a whole series. Uh, it's because the golden ratio of five, bop, 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 as a continued fraction, as a continued fraction, mask of raven, right? And for me, I don't, I don't go through it from that angle, right? And this stuff, by the way, is related to a playlist that we have which is uh, the playlist is uh, mathematics of art and this art and design and it's basically i got together with uh, this friend of mine where um, i wanted to show the mathematics because he showed me his art i'm like dude this is all just pure mathematics he's like yeah yeah i use a lot of mathematics in my art uh so we agreed in the early stages of me collaborating with people to get together and look at the mathematics that he uses in his art and here's a playlist for it boop sub the favorite <laughs> nice and that's the playlist for it so it was just us getting together and uh just seeing what he showed me and we ended up doing things and we put out two videos on the golden uh spiral right golden rectangle because he showed me how he generates the uh, like he has a lot of art he has a lot of paintings and he does furnitures furniture is amazing the stuff he makes he makes statues sculptures like he's an all-around artist there's a link to and he's got a page on hello i gotta update that but there's a link to his website on those two videos okay and on the playlist right but basically he was doing drawings that were like this and then if you looked at the pattern he was doing it was basically a golden rectangle or the, the spiral and you would see sort of this within his drawings and stuff like this i was like oh that's cool and then he showed me drawings where he was doing something and you see the stuff through in uh, uh, in comic book pages a lot right in art a lot is this the artist whom you have uh, t-shirts of his work uh no i don't have t-shirts of his work uh a ripper uh, we never collaborated with art we just collaborated well we did i guess math and art on that level i love his video uh videos he has such an interesting way of expressing himself i would love to spend an afternoon getting uh, getting high with him gina 
you would love to spend the weekend uh, together. And I've done a couple of times, two or three, four. Well, we partied together a little bit. And the conversations are... Me and him hit it off. We met at my cousin's place and we hit it off within 10 seconds. <laughs> like, we're like, ah, do, 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 boom. And we just, from there, it just grew, right? Fantastic human being. Fantastic human being. And he was a pretty... He did pretty good with the DJ scene and Ibiza during a period uh he was he's, he's a cool cat he's a character he's he's 100 authentic by the way okay oh never mind that's a family member of yours i believe family member possibly okay and he had he has stuff like this where you do an art where he has perspective where you can put an eyelid here like put an eye here and if you look at a piece of his art you can draw lines right and then you would see perspective like three-dimensional perspective this way and, and whatnot and then he would maybe have another perspective here coming up and just overlaying a lot of geometric patterns a lot of stuff like this right so one of the these two videos we put together was regarding the expansion of the Fibonacci uh, sequence into the golden ratio okay and mask of raven wrote down the sequence uh, da, 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 da. Um, what's the sequence there is phi let's write down phi phi is equal to one plus one over two one. is it uh oh i forget what the pattern is one plus one over one plus one plus one over one plus one plus some something like this it's some kind of sequence like this right but i approach it from uh, from this angle this angle is basically um, a sequence of numbers patterns that a person called Fabunucci have you spell his name <laughs> I don't look it up to be able to spell his name uh, hold on let's see Fabunucci 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 here we go let me write down his name f-i-b-o-n f-i-b-o-n uh, a-c-c-i a-c-c-i so look up Fibonacci, and you will get this pattern. And the pattern is basically this, okay? The pattern is, uh, and hello everyone, Lark, how are you doing? Hello, hello, welcome, welcome. Uh, and the pattern is basically this. It says start off with, I, you know what, I tell you the truth, I don't know if he included zero at the beginning. I always know it for starting from one and one. I'm not 100% sure if you have zero, but let's assume we started with zero, right? So he says, start, create your own pattern. Like for example, a pattern could be created, a law, a rule, and an algorithm can be created any which way you want, right? I usually just round to that. Eight digits is sufficient for most real world applications. Cool, cool. So just imagine if we made our own pattern. Let's say we start with number five, right? And our rule is to get the next number, add three, right? So plus three, and the next number is eight. And this continues once you add a rule you don't change it right at three you get 11 next number at three you get 14 next number at three and you get 17 and so on right now between these numbers you could do two things you could add commas right doop, 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 doop. and that makes it a uh, sequence or you can make it a series where you just add additions right you say add the numbers or subtract the numbers or whatever it is, right? That's just a pattern. And then what you can do is look at the pattern and see where it takes you. Like, what is this pattern? Does it reveal anything to us, right? Here's a starting point. The simplest algorithm, like seriously, one of the most simplest algorithm you can begin with, right? If you think about it, chemistry, biology, just our analysis of the world, the universe where we are how we came to be is basically how did this whole thing start there must have been a starting point to existence right and you can explore certain starting points certain algorithms through the realm of mathematics because what you can do is say okay let's create a law let's create a rule the rule is start with the number five add three every time and let's see what that generates does that generate life at the end in the limit does it explain certain things about our world right Fibonacci did the same thing. Fibonacci went, you know what? Let's begin with a rule, a law. 
an algorithm and see where it takes us, right? Does it reveal anything about the world? Does it tell us anything? Is there a mathematical algorithm basis? Is there is there mathematics behind what we see in the world, right? And he says this. He says, start with the number zero and then go one, right? To generate the next number, add the previous two numbers, right? So to generate the next number, add the previous two numbers. Zero plus one is one. Cool. What's our rule? To generate the next number, add the previous two numbers. One plus one is two. Cool. What's our rule? To generate the next number, add the previous two numbers. One plus two is three. Cool. What's our rule? To generate the next number, add the previous two numbers. Two plus three is five. Cool. What's our rule? To generate the next number, add the previous two numbers. Three plus five is eight. Cool. What's our next number? To generate the next number, add the previous two numbers. Cool. Five plus eight is 13. Do, do, do. We apply the same rule. We just keep on doing the same thing. Okay, what do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Well, one of the things they noticed is that one of the things they noticed is that population growth, right, follows this pattern for certain types of species. Okay. I'm just going to, well, I need to finish the Discord right up on, on this. There's been a lot of questions on the Golden Ratio. Really, Masquerade? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, there was something before you wrote up on our Discord page, right? And by the way, if you guys want to participate in, like, just talking about mathematics, any questions you have, we do have a Discord page, and there's a folder, mathematics folder there, which is pretty cool. There's people that are helping uh, other people out and sharing information. And there's a lot of people there that their mathematics is a lot more powerful than mine, right? So they can answer questions. Um, if they have the time or whatnot. So there's a nice mathematics discussion taking there. Mathematics, Chicho. So this is one thing the guy did, and the guy goes, okay, from what I understand, rabbits multiplying follows this pattern, right? Like, I forget what it looks like. I might have to look certain things up because it's very visual as well, right? I wanna make sure you give the visual. But what you can do is say, okay, let's assume you have, uh, one and one how does this work when you do the rabbits you go one and then one splits up into uh one and two and then two splits up into or this one splits up into one and two again i think and then this one splits up into three and five or no that's not the way it works oh, i told i haven't looked at this forever man uh i just got here but this is really relaxing to listen to also meatball uh, I thought rabbits were exponential. Are rabbits exponential? I thought rabbits were were with Fibonacci sequence. Let me look this up. Okay, so we're gonna do this together. We're gonna do it nice and slow and enjoy our our uh, our little uh, what do you call it? Fibonacci uh, rabbits. Fibonacci rabbits. That's all I'm doing a search on. Let's see if it works. Uh, image Oop, there it is nice so if you do Fibonacci rabbits here I'll give you the link to DuckDuckGo I'm using DuckDuckGo for my searches because there's different types of things on this Oop, so here's the drawings here's what they got uh, zero one two uh, and then it goes like that is that the way they do it yeah there it is oh god which one are we gonna do which drawing uh, one goes to one. Uh, you prefer DuckDuckGo? I I'm use I've been I'm using DuckDuckGo way more. Certain things I still use Google for. Um, Dang Dangjos, which one do you use? Start page, right? But because I know Google is censoring a lot of information, I rather access do a search uh, with a platform that doesn't censor, right? So this would be our rabbit. Let's use this one, I guess, here. Let me see if I got uh, Yahoo search. <laughs> also funny. 
Yahoo search. Doop, doop. Oh god, which which one are we gonna use? Here's the rabbit one. I'm trying to. There it is. So if you have one, here, let's do this. Let's call it one couple. So when you see one here, it's a couple. Okay, so that was my mistake. I always assume, I always take it as being one rabbit, but it's a couple. So if I write down here, I'll put a box. So a box means a couple. One and one, I guess. Is it a couple? We'll call it, well, no, no, we're not gonna call it one one. It's just a couple. One is a couple. So one goes to one. So one goes to one. Okay, and then they multiply, they go to two right and then these guys multiply right yeah these guys multiply and this guy oh yeah there's a gap in per generation so this is one and then this is one and then this becomes two and then this becomes if they're in the same row three and then these guys have a gap is it hold on this guy splits up into two right and then you have one of these guys splits into two, doop, doop. and then this one doesn't split into two, right? So this becomes five, and this continues. You can do the growth thing on this. And from what I understand, I'm not a bio biologist, but from what I understand, this is pretty close to the way rabbits multiply. So going back to mathematics, what happened? Fibonacci sequence revealed something about rabbits multiplying. That is crazy. That's trippy, right? A rule that we just came up with in mathematics actually is occurring in nature, right? So that brings up the question, is there a starting algorithm for rabbits, right? Is there a mathematics behind this, right? I mostly use Google. I only use DuckDuckGo for things I don't want anyone to know I'm searching. Um, I would, uh, if you're, by the way, this is straight up, if, if you guys are doing it, I've, ex I've experimented with this, right? I've tried this out. If you're only using Google for searches, you're not, you're being censored. Like there's information you're not going to see, right? I've, I've done the two things, look, look, go Google. I've done it in private mode. I've done it through VPNs. All of a sudden there's certain images that you will not find on Google that you can find on DuckDuckGo. And those are political images. I'm not talking about any nasty stuff. I'm talking about political images that appear on DuckDuckGo that will not appear on Google. For example, do a search for Clinton Epstein. See what you find, right? Our universe is mathematics. Our universe is mathematics, right? So all of a sudden, the sequence, right? So we had a base sequence of these numbers that all of a sudden showed, showed us some kind of pattern in the real world. Well, our first rule here was rule one. Rule, well, rule was to get the next number, to get next next number add previous two oops numbers right that was our algorithm that gave us this sequence right i should actually put this rule up here because you get you come up with the rule and then you come up with the sequence right so i'm just going to write this here that way you see the progression of thought right Okay, so rule to get the next number at the previous two numbers start start with zero and one start with zero and one start with zero oops zero and one right so we started with zero and one and then to get the previous number right or maybe we put start with zero and one at the beginning and then you add the rule right so let's do it that way what kind of terrifying things are you up to today hope to fall uh the most terrifying thing uh is what am i terrified i don't think i'm into terrifying things today right start with zero and one start with zero and one to get the next number at the previous two numbers that looks like a pretty good algorithm right math is pretty scary math is pretty scary could be it's about to reveal some stuff that'll blow you away about the world. What? 
No way. Just with the simple rule? Rule. Start with 0 and 1. <laughs> to get the next number, add previous two numbers. Okay. Well, we found out that this sort of mirrors, rabbits multiply sort of mirrors this pattern, right? You need an old school chalkboard, man. That would be a so uh, the problem with chalkboard. I, I do have a chalkboard. The problem with chalk is it creates a lot of dust, man. It's like pff, I'm breathing that stuff in, not good, right? So I decided not to go chalk, I decided to go to whiteboard. Okay, what it reveals is scary to some, well, it's scary to some. Aren't fractals related to this rule? Yes, 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 indeed, indeed, could be, could be, could be, right? Don't want to breathe chalk dust, don't want to breathe, not all day not for extended period of time because i do these with you guys for a couple hours but i also have students that i do this with right so health whatever work you do you should consider how it's going to affect your health because you want to be here for the long game right the long run you don't want to do things extreme yolo and that's it it's over bye bye <laughs> right you only live once might as well live a long time if you can help it right and healthy gold gold number is more interesting than fibonacci well gold number comes from the fibonacci a bob ross canvas i'm a fan of whiteboard both visually and for listening yeah i wonder if the uh, summation of the inverse of fibonacci numbers is con convert convergent <laughs> nice nice and here's the thing right where we're leading to now we started with this this rule came up with this number this sequence and then looked at the world and went oh wow this cool this is super cool right well let's come up with another rule rule oops rule starting from one in one right so this rule says because you're not going to start with zero uh, yeah you're not going to start with zero uh, starting with one and one divide the first number by the next number is that the rule well and by the way if i make any mistakes regarding the rules let me know right I'm, i've never written down the rules like this because if we're going to explain it might as well go deep into it right is it true that Fibonacci came up with this because his teacher gave him a math problem as punishment and he was looking for a conclusion? I don't know. I don't know the history behind it, right? Uh, uh, particulate can be harmful. It's said that someone working around a lot of copy uh, copiers using toner is akin to working in a coal mine. Oh, is it? Damn. That's nasty. I know that the cartridges, if you want to get them refilled, they used to do them locally. Now you can't because the stuff you have to send in, they say it's not safe, right? Irrational numbers uh, bring us closer to God. <laughs> nice. <laughs> now take a look at this. The next pattern that we want to take a look at, the rule is this. Take a number divided by the previous number, right? So take this number divided by the previous number and then to get the second number, take this number divided by that number, and then take this number divided by that number, take this number divided by that number, take that one divided by that number. We're gonna come up with a new pattern, right? So you're gonna go one divided by one is your first number, right? Which is just one. So I'm just gonna write down, if it's a whole number, I'm just gonna write it down, right? So one divided by one is one, and then one divided by two is one over two, and then two divided by three, and then three divided by five, and then five divided by eight, and then eight divided by 13, right? The next number here would be 21, right? Because eight plus 13 is 21. And then the next number here would be 13 divided by 21, and so on and so forth, right? So we're coming up with a new sequence, new pattern based on the previous pattern. So this pattern is really a two algorithm two rule pattern that we just came up with right now i'm not sure technically if this is, this is actually let me say what the limit is if you continue this pattern if you continue this pattern right 
what you end up with you start getting closer to something called the golden ratio okay and the golden ratio is it phi uh, uh, mask is that what it's called is this the pattern here let me do the uh, let me write down the sequence of numbers that comes up with it Fibonacci golden ratio golden golden so I can write down the sequence golden ratio uh, what is the sequence what is the sequence where the series where is it where is it come on hey oh there it is oh yeah look at that that's the reason why I don't remember it oh yeah I'm not gonna write down that sequence right now that's gonna be take up too much space where is it do they have a simplified version no they don't oh do they okay apologies if I'm not Beep. looking at it properly but here let me check the chat see if uh, hey Chicho, you're looking at the golden ratio super cool i posted this in the discord a few weeks back ah ding bobber okay it was you that posted and mask of raven i think replied to you there's a nice pattern with uh gcd uh, where fn is the nth fibonucci number hello nice beer thanks okay so let's go to the golden ratio uh i'm not gonna write down this pattern this pattern is, is too much it's uh, because i've never looked at it i don't use it in this form right actively golden ratio here's the golden ratio so if we take the what do you call it take your calculator okay let's punch these in so this is one right this is 0 0.5 this is 0 0.6 repeating this is 0 0.6 oops, 0 0.6 What's five divided by eight as a decimal? Five divided by five divided by eight is 0 0.0.625. Eight divided by 13. Eight divided by 13. You get 0 0.6154. Uh, okay, rounded. And then you get 13 divided. 13 divided by. 21 you get the next number is 0 0.6196190 uh, if you're rounding right if you continue this pattern continue this pattern right the more higher up you go in the sequence the closer you get to what is called the golden ratio which is 0 0.6 uh, one eight zero three 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 dot 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 right this is called a golden ratio you can look at it this way or you can look at it in this pattern as well uh, what's the other version of it it's one point one point six because it's just this flipped right if you go one divided by that zero point six one eight zero three three it should be anyway let me do it with a calculator one divided by uh, point there it is six one eight zero three three whatever Boop. you get this number one point uh where is it again six one uh eight zero etc three etc so these numbers are the same right that's that number and this number is one divided by that number so it's basically instead of saying starting with one and one divide you know anyway do you see you see the rule divide the previous number you say oh take one number divided by the previous number that would generate this for you if you say start with a number divide the next number start with one and one take first number divide next number next number so to generate the next number it takes first number divide the next number pop, 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 pop. you get the whole thing and this gives you the golden ratio these two numbers okay now why is this important 
why is this important uh, so it's approaching the golden ratio minus one so it's approaching the golden ratio minus one right or the flip of it okay should be i hope so uh, da -da 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 -da. i'm uh, intrigued by the fact that almost all of them are 0.6 some something despite being vastly uh, different whole numbers at the start so so what level of math is this <laughs> accessible once you know addition multiplication yeah all you need to know is addition really because multiplication is addition right and division division is just subtraction but subtraction is just addition so once you know addition right and you you've explored addition to be able to get the next three operations which are subtraction multiplication and division right you have access to a code that seems to exist in the universe right a pattern that seems to exist in the universe that's how mathematics is with your first step of learning how to add numbers and a little bit of time to explore what that where that takes you and playing around with just whole numbers right you can you can see a code in the universe insanity crazy how powerful is mathematics yeah it's the most powerful thing you can learn in life period end of story really okay uh, all you need is a little bit of time right a little bit of time all right i was going to ask that holy graham how you doing so what's so important about this series so what's so important about this series okay so we got this whole thing um i'm going to erase this we're going to look at some of the important aspects of this whereas and oh that's what i wanted uh gina is that what it is so the pattern is this here let's write down this formula thank you gina here i'm going to take these down so we got a pattern a, fo a formula for it which is n over n minus 1 is equal to 1.6 let's write down the numbers 180 well it's just this guy 1803 dot 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 but n uh should i put them both on the same i'm gonna write them smaller so i can just use put them up here 1.61803 uh, dot 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 and the other pattern we have is n over n plus one which is equal to this guy zero point six one eight zero three dot 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 okay i think one of its most uh crucial arithmetic properties is, is that it's square golden ratio squared and it's reciprocal have the same infinite decimal places infinite decimal places they mirror each other seriously that is crazy cool that was super cool i didn't know about that one patriotic uh lucio like seriously i looked into the stuff by the way like 20 years ago so i'm going a little bit by memory other than making this video with uh with dirk that we made right i was into the solids the special solids uh, looked into the stuff it was pretty cool stuff the bad math is intriguing how we quantify life how we quantify life it's good subject to learn but i still don't know the practical use of it hello hello sorry i'm late no worries by the man uh, uh chicho it truly is the most powerful uh powerful science which most base life on is uh based on mathematics itself based on mathematics itself hello everyone hello good 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 haha <laughs> just messing nice okay so that's one thing we see now the sequence was this so let's write down the sequence as well we had uh, 0 1 1 2 3 5 8 13 because we're going to need that okay and do we need this guy uh, do we need this guy do we need this guy yeah might as well write it down since we have it right now one uh one over two we can generate it easy two over three but might as well have it up there oops three over five 
uh, 3 over 5, 5 over 8, uh, 8 over 13, uh, 13 over 21, and dot, dot, dot. Right? Okay, that's what we've got so far, right? Practical use example is that every good agriculture, I, uh, our architecture, uh, use um, golden numbers, right? So let's take this down. But that's not necessarily in nature. It is, right? Because we are part of nature. But let's take a look at what the nature aspect, where we can find this, right? Practical, da, 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 da. If you look at the generating function, you get characteristic equations. Uh, x squared equals x plus 1. And the golden ra uh, ratio is a root of this equation. Uh, gram. Mathematics is good to learn because of its broad application. You can find math if you look hard enough everywhere. The more math you, um, ba -ba 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 -ba, you know, the more you see. Uh, does it have tangible uh, utility? Perhaps, perhaps not. But as with most learning, that may not be the best reason to learn something. By the way, gang. I got my peanut butter and apple snack and it's very delicious. I'm going to do a little peanut butter apple snack. Okay. Peanut butter is dry, apple is nice and juicy. Right? So they complement each other phenomenally. Gina, that's what I'm going to get into snail shells and stuff right i get um this one is a smooth one i get both the crunchy and the smooth but just organic peanut butter cheers thank you very much for the cheers uh cheer 100 classic snack <laughs> classic snack nice <laughs> oh none no no oh no not joe oh no not joe thank you very much for the cheers nice the drinks are out what are we drinking tonight i'm just drinking tea tonight right now but check this out okay let's go into the shells right we're not going to use the golden ratio uh, golden ratio i would have to look up some of the things we have to do i might even have to look this up i haven't done it since the video basically or i do it with my students every now and then but i look it up usually all right let's assume we start with this okay forget the zero let's start with one Let's make a box. Mm, how am I going to make it? I'll do it in center because sometimes I get it the wrong way going, right? So let's assume we start off with one box. And then we're going to add another box to it. Right? So we've got two boxes. So one, one, and then we've got two, right? Which is this pattern. So we're going to do two. The diam the what do you call it the the length of the edge is now two two units whatever it is right now you would say two pen lengths pen widths right that looks like the length of it right it doesn't it doesn't make a difference what your unit is right take one unit of something a square box put another unit of a square box beside it and then from there keep on making the boxes based on the length of the edges. So if this is one, this is two, and that's two as well, right? And then the next number is three. So that's one, that's two. So we make a square, that's three, okay? So the length of an edge here is three, right? Cool. Now the next number is five. Where can we make a five? Well, two plus three is five. So our next box is five. The length of this thing is five, right? It's a square, so the length is five. Okay, what do we get next? Well, three plus five is eight. That's eight. Okay, cool. Uh, or we could do it here, go this way. No, let's go this way. Here's eight. So this so it's this length, that length. Yeah, that looks like a square. That's eight. Cool. So this is eight. 
what do we got next? 8, next number is 13. So 8 plus 5 is 13. Cool. So let's make a length of 13. So we're going to take that, bring it all the way down to here. So at least we make it like look like a square, right? Does that look like a square? Oh, it's a little bit too long to here. So let's make it look like a square. Sure, let's make it here. All right. So what's the what's the length of an edge? It's 13. Cool. All right. What do we got next? The next number is 21, right? Now I'm not gonna go in that direction. This is the problem I do. I go in the wrong direction. But 8 plus 13 is 21, right? 8 plus 13 is 21. That's the next number in the sequence, right? Well, I don't have the this the space there, but it doesn't make a difference because this is 8. That means this is 8, right? 5, 2, 1, that's 8, which is the same thing as 8. And here's our 13. So our next square is 21, right? What an awesome visual to explain this. This box examples, <laughs> nice reference. I really like this, right? And then this is 21. So we're going to take this length and, and we're on the whole page. So we're going to go all the way here, right? And then all the way here. And then we got 21. So this is 21, right? Now, if we want to go the next number, what's 21? 21 plus 13, 4, 3, 34. What's 13 plus 21? 34. Are we going to go? Oh, it's too big. Oh, it's too big. We're going to stop here, right? The sequence continues. You could just grow this, right? What, what is this? This is called the golden rectangle. And it can grow in a spiral, right? This is called the golden rectangle, right? Because the ratio of the sides from the previous rectangle is the golden rectangle it's 13 from 13 8 over 13 we've got 13 over 8 so it's just it's the same numbers right i'm dabbing in your honor <laughs> so check this out what you can do now is create the golden uh create the spiral right which brings us back to the beginning of the stream the spiral method the spiral right so what we can do is now how does this work i start off here and i go hit hit here and then hit here oh how does this work oh man i gotta look at my hold on let me look at my own drawing because i always get this the wrong way i always uh, if you go to my i'm looking at my video by the way right now right <laughs> You start off. Hold on. Where are we going? Doop, doop, doop. Oh, hold on. I gotta get to the level where it's the rectangle. Oh yeah, it goes from there to there to there to there. Okay, cool. Oh, and I should have. Uh, we need this part over here. Okay, what would this be? This would be two. I'm gonna draw it here as well. I'm gonna extend it. Ah, can I do it without doing it? Uh, oh, I should have gone up as well. That's the way I should have done. So from here to here, this would be five, right? One plus one plus three is five, right? And then what do we got? What do we got? And then, oh, and then eight would have been here. Oh, poop. I needed this guy to be in the center. Oh, I should have looked it up before I did this. <laughs> I should have looked it up before I did this. Hold on a second. Have you ever built up an uh, entheogenic experience using the Fibonacci sequence? I don't think I have. You should draw correctly. I know I should, Chicho. I watched that video where you drew this uh, with chalk. Yeah, it was awesome. But I, I needed to put this in the center, the two things. Oh, I can do it here. I can do it this way. Check this out. Oh, hold on. hold on. I'm going to show you something. I got I got these little little dry erase things, right? That have like erasers that you can use instead of my rag so you can I can edit this. Check this out. Check this out. I can take this out. 
All right, I can take this out. Nice, and just flip it. Nice, nice, nice. We're gonna keep this one handy. Uh, who was that guy you featured who was uh, applying the ratio to Zy? His name is Dirk Mar uh, Marwig. He's, you know what? I'm gonna give you his LO uh, feed. He's, um, because that's where he shares his stuff and he's got a Facebook page as well. Uh, ba -ba -ba, da -da 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 -da. Uh, following da, 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 da. here we go here's Dirk's LO page and he's got a nice nice amount of followers here like 13,000 plus followers and uh, so follow his work on LO it's good to be on multiple different social platforms because some platforms are geared towards more art and less politics and stuff like this so that's his LO social page where he shares a lot of art and stuff like this uh, so you can follow his work there does he ever hang out in your discord no 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 I could get him to uh, he's he's in Vancouver now I've told him to I've asked him to come and visit me I, I suggested you know he's welcome to come visit me but we're both very um, you know we're on our own world right uh, but we will we're definitely going to touch base again for sure I want to do a follow-up with his art and go set up there with him again in the studio and do more mathematics right but this was one this was one this was two there our problem fixed nice so this is what we're gonna do we're gonna start off where are we starting off in the video I think between the two ones we start off with we start off here where do we start off we start off here and then we go no we start off here 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 there we go that's what we're doing so check this out I'm gonna do this with pink what color is gonna come out black let's do this with black because we want the we want the thing to pop out right so if you start off at this point here and then where does this go three four, hold on a second the five goes from here okay we're going from the five to the eight. Oh, the 13 had to be up there poop uh, oh we can go this way oh my god let me see if I can figure it out. <laughs> so starting from the two one, I did. I need the extra. I need the space here. I'm trying to do it without without getting on there, but it's not working. Two goes to three. Two goes to three. Goes to here, and then it would have to go that that way. Did I? So we needed the two. We need that. We got the three and then we had the three and then the five and then the eight should have been over here because we're going to start that way we could go the other way hold on a second let me see if somebody's got a solution in chat <laughs> hey, Chicho, hope you and chat are good I'm, I'm 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 doing good chad's doing good but i'm trying to figure out how to draw the spiral on this maybe erase and start I know I don't want to erase the whole thing but it'd be faster if I erase and start the whole thing here let's do this let's fix this up okay let's fix this up what do we got so we got the, that that and then we got the two and then we got the three and then from the three we're gonna hit up the da, 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 five should we go there no we're gonna no this is the five once we got the five then we're gonna go to the side we should have been this side okay let's do it 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 if we only went this way when i got to this stage eh? it would have worked out perfectly so we're gonna go from five we're gonna go to eight because five plus one plus two is eight right Here's our eight, right? Yep. And then we're gonna go to 13, and 13 we're gonna go up. 
Yeah, and then we can go... <laughs> Wait, sure, I think so. And then we're going to go 13. So this length up here, so we're going to go here, right? That's what we want. That's looking more legit. That's right, because you can go in any direction you want. Now, just imagine people trying to come up with a pattern like this. They would have, they could have done multiple versions of this, that the spiral, you couldn't create the spiral. But then all of a sudden they came up with this pattern, this arrangement, and then the spiral appeared, right? So there's patterns within patterns within patterns, which is absolutely amazing. Really, it's absolutely amazing. And then from there, we can go to this side. Should we go to this side? So we're going to go zero. We're going to go here, 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 here. Are we? So we're going to go, wait a second, we're going to go here, 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 here. Oh, that'll work. And then we want to go there. That's right. Yeah, that's exactly where we need to go. So, okay, I'm not going to draw that yet. Let's make sure we've got the pattern before we go there, right? So, how do we do this again? <laughs> we go here, not here. We start here. Do, do, do. Yeah, this is what we do. Let's say you start here, right? Go to the edges of the nodes where they touch, right? So if you go here, oh, let me get a darker one. I think I just brought out a new one, which is darker. Nice. Look at that. Look at that. So we start here. And then we go to here, right? And then we go to here. 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 Oh, I should draw this like a nice curve. We go to here. And then we go to here. And then we go to here, right? What you see is the spiral pattern that we get with shells oops right and if we continue this here let's go so we got 8 plus 13 is 21 so let's assume we'd be there now the length is not perfect right that's the reason i should have thought about it before i laid it out right that's why Dirk is an artist and I'm not, right? I'm more of the um, here, and then you would go here, right? And then from there, you can take it down to here, right? Because this would be 21, right? So 21 plus that was uh, 40, uh, 34. So you would just go here, right? Again, we limit it with the space that we have. And you would go here, and then you would go here, right? And then you continue it. You do this, and then you would come here and go here. You could just go there and keep on, keep on growing the thing, right? Now, the stuff we put out regarding how you create the spiral pattern I approached the spiral this way. I used to know this better, better, by the way, when to start it, where to put the ones and ones, right? But Dirk, the way he did it was doing calculations and putting uh, a metric here and drawing a circle and stuff like this where he shows us how to do it in that first video, which is absolutely amazing, right? Because I had, I knew about it, but I never, I was never able to generate it that way because I found this one to be a lot easier a lot easier way to generate the golden spiral right so super cool super cool we'll drawing the golden ratio yeah boop, boop. let's check it out uh go clockwise okay i'm just gonna get caught up with chat <sighs> and by the way ding bobber thank you for saying maybe erase it and start again oh made our lives so much easier that's my solution awesome solution by the way if you see you've done something wrong you can't patch it up start again right sometimes it's the best way how about you start big and go small yeah I, yeah the problem with it's just the ratios you get right at least this doesn't look bad it looks okay 
think about it going clockwise so then 21 right 34 down 55 left yeah so we just go here and you're going from node to node right <laughs> hey there chichonians in chat how is the math today coolio how are you doing you went to the pro uh, demonstrations I meant to say chicho and the chat chichonians <laughs> nice uh, learning math at a level i never got to in high school haha <laughs> nice nice uh, i've heard of the golden uh ratio before but never seen it mathematically drawn out cool i just got here and i'm a few classes behind into a bottle <laughs> i'm totally lost <laughs> early you're early yeah you're starting early maybe nice uh there's a fibonacci compass you can use is there x like what is that emote drawing <laughs> no go oh you're going on wednesday okay that's when the next schedule will be along uh protests in detroit oof that's going to be crazy right so golden ratio of Fibonacci sequence where is it come andy i mean this is pretty cool like this is this is shells growing and then you can kick it up into the patterns of plants they optimize the pattern of their leaves spreading to get maximum sun the angle is related to the golden ratio and stuff like this it's just so much you can take it to a level where they say uh the distance from the top of your head to your belly button and the distance from the top of your head to your to your toes right if you take the average of the world for all of humanity it comes out to the golden ratio now i don't look too much deeper into that for me it's just enough to know that there are major patterns in the universe all around us that are based on just numbers like that's incredible to me right should be to anyone really speaking of spirals the spiral in a galaxy is the same spiral in your fingerprints ah oh, cool Right. also found out my company is gonna have people come back to the office on june 15th hopefully the numbers are dropped a little more but hopefully hopefully it's late here in the uk this is totally uh appropriate rum drinking time <laughs> nice okay good on you brother and we're in the afternoon here so afternoon is not a bad time to drink rum either yes indeed brother personally this consolidates my faith in a creator cool whatever it does for you i think it's pretty damn cool right i think the a paper sizes use the golden ratio uh, so a3 and a4 uh, or a5 uh, are at the same ratio speaking under correction uh correction so the for the papers you use in the printers and stuff like this right in photocopiers and whatnot nice yeah it's amazing it's amazing regardless dang three i wonder how many times we forgive someone just because we don't want to lose them look of sacred geometry yeah sacred geometry is amazing geometry on google images and your faith will increase yeah or on duck duck go images right by the way gang should we do a little unboxing <laughs> since we did a little mathematics <laughs> little unboxing yes x says i'll have to rewatch the beginning part of the stream later to catch up on the parts i missed on the golden ratio the golden ratio is fantastic yes duck duck go uh, or ecosia ecosia haven't used ripper ripper open gina says okay gang this thing is uh sort of a care package that ripper that's in chat right now sent my way he asked me if he could send me something as that I, he thought i would appreciate so he sent this it took a couple of weeks to get here and i just picked it up yesterday and i told him that uh i'll just keep it with me during the streams and whenever he was here we crack it open and he showed he came on the first stream we're doing for matt he said he was going to be here but you know there's a lot of things going on so i don't want to i want to make sure people are committed to family friends health more important than unboxing sometimes sometimes chicho fan mail chicho fan mail that's what it is i guess chicho fan mail let's crack this open i love that gina has turned me into a verb <laughs> awesome 
So let's crack this open. Should I be careful with this, uh, by the way, uh, Ripper? Uh, you got nice packaging on this, by the way. Okay, I'm in. Chicho, you should use uh, Ecosia. It plants trees with the revenue from your searches. I've planted over 1,200 trees using it. Uh, also, it doesn't track you. Okay, I'll look into it. I'll look into it. Thank you for the recommendation. I bet there's something comic book related in that just to get I don't know as I didn't I didn't know how big the package was or anything so I didn't know if it was a box coming uh, uh like Ripper said he ran out of Ripper beanies because he's he's a professional wrestler wrestler so he said he might send a Ripper beanie I'm like Ripper beanie 100 percent right so I didn't know if it was going to be anything but I as soon as I saw this my guess would be something like that of course use the bloodshot knife my bloodshot knife is uh worn down a little bit you can talk about the uh, kepler trying kepler trying let's check this out nice packaging by the way nice Very wise ass sister who possibly had it. We have a pro wrestler Chichonia. We have a pro wrestler Chichonia. Awesome. Nice. Oh, you got, oh, that's right. You put a letter in here, brother. Okay, I haven't, I'm looking at the letter. I don't know what's in there yet. Okay, cool. So let's check this out, man. Hold on, should I flip it to see what's on the... Okay, it's, it's... What does this say? Oh, I'm not going to read that. Okay, he wrote a letter. So, uh, Ripper told me that it was okay to read the letter. As soon as the company is back to work, I'll have new ones made. Nice. I might have to give Ripper beanies or something. Hell yeah, Ripper beanies, man. Between Martin and Ripper, the Chicho, the Chicho fan base has pretty good uh, protection. Pretty good protection. And we can get together in a club okay we gotta read this man let's check this out dear chicho greetings brother how are you sir doing well ripper thank you very much um first of all so here's a letter by the way okay so i'm just gonna read this to you guys uh, let's check this out okay so dear chicho greetings brother how are you sir first of all i want to give you permission to read this letter in a video if you'd like the opposite are you still sure about this ripper <laughs> Let's check it out. Oh, handwritten, 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 right? And everything, nice indeed, right? The opposite side of this backing board has DC content to entertain the viewers while you read. Haha, -ha. as I've said it in chat, I found you through your comic book ASMR videos, and I'm forever grateful of your content for entertaining teaching relaxing and um you're, you're <laughs> what you're, uh telling me it 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 telling me in instilling me instilling me the n and the s <laughs> so, instilling in me oh instilling this continues i gotta read that sentence again i found you through your comic book asmr videos and i'm and i'm forever grateful for your content for entertaining teaching relaxing and instilling me instilling in me values and and anecdotes that i now carry with me on a daily basis wow thank you brother um you've impacted viewers around the world which is the um <laughs> what check okay check this out 
check this out. I'm just taking a little break from reading that. That's intense. Okay. Uh, purchased directly from artist Shelby Robertson. One in 25 print run. Current value $65 May 2020. Cool. Okay, man. Um, content for teaching, relaxing, and instilling in me values and anecdotes that I now carry with me on a daily basis. You've impacted viewers around the world, which is the absolute coolest thing. I'm going to read some chat. An apple and peanut butter. Reading a chat is hard, man. Stop reading chat now. Okay, let's read. Must be done. Thank you. <laughs> uh, dope letter. Uh, yeah. Beautiful spiral. Mathematics is a lot easier to deal with than this. Okay. Uh, 
Let's try it again. Okay, let's try it again. You've impacted viewers around the world. You're you've impacted viewers around the world which is the absolute coolest thing ever i hope you set step back and breathe in uh, the impact your work and you as a person have had what the Sure about my vape. Right. Have had on people around around our world. You called me a friend in one video, and I valued that and reciprocate that infinitely fold. I think I'm uh, drank too much fluids. I'm leaking, right? With that, I came across something that I found perfect for your collection. <clears throat> I was only eight years old when Valiant launched and could not afford their 350 US cover price. But after discovering your videos, I have searched out pre-Unity Valiant and love them. This book is an art preview one shot showcasing Shelby Robertson's work. I know of your love for Bloodshot. And as we know, Bloodshot's first appearance was in Rise Zero. The cover of this book is a tribute to Rise Zero. The cover of this book is a tribute to Rise Zero, Bloodshot, and the back cover is a tribute to Amazing Spider-Man number 300. I purchased this directly from Shelby's company, AmericanDiscord.com. Hope you enjoy. Hope, thank you for all you do. And who you are. Ripper, if I catch you in a arena, I'm gonna body slam you. Okay. Much love and peace, Zach the Ripper Connor. Let's do. version of it take a look take a look take a look take a look oh <laughs> oh my god look at the 
this thing. Well, we gotta crack it open. We gotta look at the back cover too, right? We kind of cover. I gotta dry my hands. You made me. You made. You made me leak. Beautiful cover. Look at this thing. Look at that. Right? Ripper. Shelby Robertson was commissioned at the age of 17 to work for Rob Layfield. He's American and uh, Czechoslovakian. He's done work for Glenn Danzing albums, comics, tattoos, and more. He's also done work in the video game industry and works side by side with Rob Railfield on a Deadpool paperback. Deadpool paperback. Awesome, brother. Awesome. Okay, let's do it. We've got to look at the back cover. I'm just going to take out, we're going to keep it in the, in the bag. I'm just going to slip out the board, right? That way we see it. So that way, because my hands are a little sweaty, man. Oh, man. I can't believe what you did with her. Jeez, I was not expecting this, brother. So we're gonna take a look at the back cover. Right. <laughs> Sweet. Look at this. <laughs> awesome. Awesome. Fantastic, fantastic. Look at this thing. Awesome, awesome. Comic page. Look at that. Beautiful, man. That isn't even here. Oh, Spider Man's not even here. <laughs> I can't river. I'm not gonna bring it up. Should I bring it? I can't bring it up, man. Rage, rage, rage number. What is this one? Rage preview. Nice. Tati, tally, ta tarty. Awesome. That's amazing. It is. It is. If you slapped it, which side would you? Uh, uh, show it uh, slabbing shows both sides, but you would show the front slabbing and you would show the front. I would show the front Okay, I would show the front Beautiful now look at this look at this, but I wouldn't I, You know what this is This is one of the few comics that I would say I want to slap right, but the kicker is we gotta We gotta include the letter this letters god damn it Rupert how could you write such a letter how could you write such a letter man wow brother the reading emails like this is easy I'm alone we're not live streaming right and it's an email I can pause I can distract myself but this handwritten letter beautifully written Look, you got amazing writing brother beautiful writing 
I gotta frame the letter. I gotta put this goes together, man. I gotta put this here. Protect the letter. Protect the letter. She sure was. Oh, man. Ripper. I spoke to Shelby directly after ordering this, and she clarified that there's only 25 in existence. Only 25 of these in existence. <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> dude. Awesome. So cool, so cool. Very, very cool. Damn. Awesome. Thank you, Ripper. Thank you very much. I'm glad we did the math before this. Oh, crap. Like, I'm done. One of a kind. One of 25, one of a kind, one of a kind for me, one of a kind. This, like, if someone came up to me and said, I'll give you two of these for the one you have, I wouldn't give it up. If they came up to me and said, I'll give you all 24 for this one, I wouldn't do it, right? <laughs> like, this is priceless, right? Oh, I just imagine how messy the goal, I had a hard time drawing a, <laughs> It wouldn't have worked. <laughs> I'm gonna put this down, okay? I don't want to put it down. It's beautiful. Look at that. Awesome. And by the way, gang, this this cover is one of the original Rise Zero cover is one of my most favorite covers for Valiant Comics ever, right? They did a tribute, like Valiant Comics did a tribute to the rise zero cover of um what was the series that was coming out it was um it wasn't book of death it was one of the crossovers they did where they had four different four or five different versions of the cover for tribute to rye number zero right i have three out of four of those ones i don't have all of them right i will at one point right but amazing amazing yeah basically uh, as ripper says basically a modern day version of what you described as an ash can yeah but ash cans there were more than 25. shaky as that's <laughs> like shaky as lies crack it open let's uh let's paste through it seriously brother i'm 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 like i'm like i i'm not set up properly because I'm, uh, my hands are very moist right now. You made them that way. But tell you what, Ripper, this is what we're going to do. We'll do a reading of this. Done deal? We're going to do a reading of this comic. Okay. With this letter is uh, one of a kind. With this letter is one of a kind, right? And add on to it, doing this on live stream. What in the world was I thinking? I should have said I'll do a video of it. Ugh my god his gift gave me an idea that i posted on discord coolio okay seeing those formulas makes me uh makes makes me miss calculus for college just notice that underdog comic i used to watch him as a kid nice the underdog yeah for sure lonely piggy thank you very much for the bits brother man appreciate it and i saw some other bits go through and subs that thank you very much for that gang i just couldn't focus like i'm trying to read i went to read the chat to calm me down i read the chat and it messed me up even more are you guys crazy like we just do what we do man we just do what we do right ripper chicho is just his art not much reading to be to be had inside he made them to show show off his work uh to get more jobs okay we do let's do it we're gonna crack it open okay but i am gonna handle it carefully i'm gonna handle it carefully oh we need the board let's do let's do <laughs> and by the way it looks beautiful outside of the bag right 
Very nice. Uh, no, it's not a clear backing board. So. Ninety four. Take a look. <laughs> so awesome, awesome, awesome. Look at this. Fantastic. Fantastic. Quite a cool way to end the mass stream. Let's look at some art, man. Nice. Oh, this is a tribute to um, New Mutants, right? Check, take a look at that. New Mutants 87. This one here. Tribute to Nimin's eighty seven with the with the thingamajiggies. Fantastic. Nah Ripper, we do, we do. We do. As Coolio said, a great oh look at this. So nice man. And did he do the inking himself? Creator artwork, yeah. President creator artwork, so it's all colorist, cobra design. Yeah, it must be. Logo design. Shelby Robertson. Okay. Shelby Robertson gang. He has his influence by Jim Lee and Todd McFarlane, and that's very clear, very clear. Uh, personally, I love the 80s, early 90s art. Me too, brother. Me too. It, it, you know what? There's, there's some people that don't appreciate the magnificence of it, right? The over the top. This is it, right? Amplifying the emotions. Beautiful. Then I came here. Nice, Alter God. Yes, that's all him. He inked. For Rob Layfield, who is the Deadpool creator. Yeah. Whoa, that is beautiful. Nice worm dragon. Look at that. Beautiful. Beautiful. Nice. Thanks, Elder God. <laughs> Sharp swords, boom, off they go. Oh, yeah, look at that. Awesome. Okay. Awesome. He's got the five, the pencils. Take a look at this. And this is super cool, right? These are pencils that you see, and then inkers come in and finishers come in, right? So these are like storyboard type of thing that you see, but then there's finishes and like it's the base of it all, right? Beautiful, beautiful, right? Tattoo style would be amazing, like you said. Right. Beautiful. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Yeah. Beautiful. <laughs> 
Look at that. And that's the back cover over here, this one. Inside of the back cover. Refer. You yourself have inked some pages with me. I did, but brother, I'm not an inker. I'm not an artist, right? It, I did it because we had a printing deadline to make and I had the inker drop out. Artists, some, you know, sometimes they're a little flaky, right? But I had to do the bubbles, the finishers, and it was distributed. So I had to do the stuff to get it to the printer. <laughs> so it didn't turn out. It was the worst comic book I had, art wise. My finishes are not good. Right. This is the back cover, right? Have you ever heard of Guild Wars? Guild Wars. Uh, it's an MMO, and I love the art in it. I will share some in the Discord. Awesome thing, Bobber classic mcfarland style right classic mcfarland style awesome fantastic ripper brother thank you very much man thank you very much man amazing Amazing. I'm gonna put this close this up so nothing happens to it. I'm definitely gonna be putting in mylar. I'm gonna make sure we protect the the letter. Jeez Louise man. I'm gonna put these guys in this. Crazy, crazy. How much is that Chicho ink jam worth nowadays? It's not Super cool, man. Super cool. It's a tutorial. Ripper, you're very welcome, my friend. Much love, brother. Much love right back, brother. Seriously. Wow, wow, wow. Wow, wow, wow. <laughs> Crazy. I was not expecting this, man. I was not expecting this. I was not expecting this. Ding Bobber Chicho, would it uh, would it be possible for me to send a l link in the chat here? I have an example of Guild Wars. Uh, no links. Only me and Moz are allowed links here, brother. So it's got to be Discord. And anyone interested can check out the Discord page, right? Art that kind of looks like that uh, what's in the book yeah who knew math makes chicho so emotional who knew man it and it really does i can honestly tell you it really does uh, math is uh, uh is uh, i consider it to be my contribution right uh the best i can do to uh to improve right Elder God says it, right? Ripper, you got a lot of heart, brother. Gina, just a correction on a previous comment that I made. I looked up the the A paper size. Oh yeah, if we need this here, uh, they actually use the square root of two as their ratio. Oh wow, that's why when you fold them in half, they retain the same ratio. Might be a nice one to do on the board oh is that what it is because if you take an 11 by 17 and fold it it's eight and a half by 11 okay right 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 so that it's a square root of two ratio that's what does it that's super cool what a great string what a great string Rusky. zob Rusky. what a great string i'm just a dude but thank you brother ripper i feel the same that's the kicker right chicho and we appreciate your contribution chicho. i'm excited for whatever happens next game on a serious note thank you chichonians for being a good kid seriously gang thank you i didn't know what to expect when we came on uh, uh twitch i just i just knew i wanted to do my my thing right 
Uh, so thank you for creating an amazing space for us to exist in. Uh, it's fantastic. Very much appreciated. Uh, I see a good emote for Twitch. Chicho, <laughs> do you, Elder God? <laughs> the number of emotes you have for Babylon 5 are crazy. So many. I'm going to look at them closely. By the way, I think I'm going to start that today. We will still have a couple of more character uh, packs to go for. MK11. Fun. Gang, should we call the stream? Let's call the stream. What a crazy stream. What a crazy stream. <laughs> what the hell? You made a half a century plus uh, guy leak water, right? Crazy. You're trying to build a prison <laughs> is that search <laughs> it's uh it's it is isn't it <laughs> Paul search <each> other. <laughs> do you have a PO box? I do think bobber I do hit me up uh, hit me up and um, we do are we cooking uh at weekend I'm not 100% sure I'm thinking about making dolmas man um I just need to I need to catch up on certain things uh, but I think so I gotta uh, maybe Sunday maybe Sunday I gotta check my schedule I gotta do a couple of uh, rotations mixing things up but I would I would like to make some dolmas we got to go shopping that's the kicker we're out of certain things and shopping experience right now is not the best experience so me and my partner have to free up the time to go shopping together because going solo is okay you know we're just gorilla style getting the stuff might as well enjoy and just go together and just chill with it and have a good time right coolio it's an emote we made because so many viewers <laughs> viewers <laughs> new to chicho make the search comparison i know i keep on getting it right <laughs> it's hilarious ding bobber chicho i would love to send you some uh, golden teacher shrooms uh with one stipulation you take them before the next alien discussion street uh brother you can't send me that kind of stuff i, I don't wanna I, I i i'm on the radar i i appreciate being under the radar uh for most of my life i don't want to deal with any any issues right there's a, there's something that you know people come onto my youtube channel and stuff and they say underrated channel oh my god how come you only have this many viewers this many viewers da, 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 da. and i tell people man i'm going at a pace that is manageable for me and i like what's happening i don't want to not that i don't want to but it's uh, i like under the radar i'm not sure if people appreciate what that means it means a lot uh, it means you have freedom so i appreciate my freedom uh, greatly okay early so messed up from this stream uh i just said search thank you <laughs> hilarious their lyric science has failed our mother earth comes to mind rest in peace the lyric science has failed our mother earth uh, our mother earth comes to mind okay i won't do don't worry yeah please don't that Serge's evil twin <laughs> uh, I ninja accessed the supermarket today skip the 50 people in queue social distance warrior elder god <laughs> awesome like for us too i i went a couple of days ago to, thinking i was going to go inside a grocery store get some supplies and i looked there was a lineup people everybody looked miserable i was like i don't want to go there man <laughs> i came back and i made pancakes today i've been eating pancakes today awesome g8 is not equal to z3 uh coast the square root of <laughs> i have no idea what that is cool here i went to the store yesterday it's an anxiety inducing experience now and i already hated going to the store see here's a kicker i loved going to the store going to the store grocery shopping for me i loved it oh look at this look at this get your stuff now it's like people are the just the energy people are stressed out right it is what it is right it is what it is uh <laughs> we can't help it 
so guys thanks for being here on the stream ripper brother wow chat i didn't i couldn't even read what you guys were putting it was amplifying what was going on so i probably end up reading it later on at some point uh exhausting <laughs> <laughs> thanks list thanks thank you gang for being here mods thank you for taking care of business as far as who i am you can find me on patreon patreon.com backslash chicho c-h-y-c-h-o uh you go there you'll know what it's about you follow the work you'll know what it's about don't you dare edit that part out uh, i won't coolio no uh, my whole spiel has been i try to be as uh, authentic as possible um so and i have a thick skin believe it or not right i really uh for me i don't try to edit myself aside from not being deplatformed off of youtube or whatever it is right i am who i am and i don't think that'll uh, uh change anytime soon right we are live streaming this on Twitch, twitch.tv.com backslash Chicho, Chicho Live, right? It could be twitch.tv or twitch.com backslash Chicho Live, C H Y C H O L I V E. Okay. I do announce these streams on Twitter, Minds, Gabs, VK, and Elo, plus I share additional information. Uh, we do upload some of the audios to SoundCloud. I might start doing it for the math stuff as well i don't know we'll see where it goes uh not yet though maybe i don't know we'll see we're playing with it the videos are going on bit shoot and youtube everything goes to bit shoot as long as there's no technical difficulties uh with the processing and most of the stuff is gonna is on youtube and will continue to be on youtube but if the sensors keep on getting tighter and tighter uh there's going to be less and less content being loaded on youtube so if you want to follow everything bitchute is where you want to be at okay aside from that gang thank you very much authentic voice in the madhouse madhouse indeed i might have to learn how to draw a golden ratio and teach my cousins thanks so my pleasure learn this it's awesome learn it better than i did don't forget how to do it i forgot how to do it not how to do it but how to lay it out so it would play out properly right wonderful stream wonderful stream thanks to you guys man youtube is your rust <laughs> bye gang i hope you enjoy your day and the next couple of days and i'll see you guys if you can make it on the math stream 2 30 p.m uh two days from now we're gonna do another math okay you guys as well lonely piggy thank you for the bits brother thank you for the subs thank you for the follows ripper thank you for the priceless love very much appreciated, brother. Peace.